Um, the, the fact is that there's so many individual stories of how people's lives have been changed over the last few years on this particular farm. It's hard to select any one story. But since Stephen de Quirke is here, um, he started out here as a security guard. So my name is Stephen de Quirke. I was working before as a security guard at Solomon's Delta. And I have opportunity to work in the museum as a wine and a heritage guide. So uh, he had the kind of mind, he was interested in what all these tourists were coming here for and acquainted himself with what the museum was about. So I'm working about five years ago, uh, five years now. I'm very interested in my job. So far so good. I'm very good. I'm 100%, I give always 100% people. You know if you come to the work, you must be always positive. You have a, a smile on your face. So he did some courses in heritage tourism and uh, next thing that's what he was doing he was guiding people around the museum and then alongside that he's always had an interest in long distance running so uh, first of all what he did was he started a walking club on the farm and then that developed into something more formalized and now uh, what he's done is he's organized with Burland Athletics a formal um, uh, mini marathon around the farm it's called Delta Draft I'm a long distance runner. I run four times the Commerce Marathon. I five times the Argus, the Cape Town Pick and Pay Cycle Tour. And I don't know how many people come to it, but it's a huge success. I expect last year about 300 people, this year about 600 people. And at the end of their run, they get a glass of Cape Jazz Shiraz. So thank you very much, everybody. Come to Solomon's Delta, enjoy it. Thank you very much. Keep it well. Cape Jazz, right? Two, three, four.